Hello and welcome to this video where I'm going to show you how to combine uh, different Serif Movie Plus projects together. So, for example, here I've got one project where I've made my opening titles and I've got some studio footage. And I've got another project, if I close this one, which contains an interview. And uh, I've cut the interview and I've put some text over it so you can see that it comes up with a little caption. And the tricky thing is I want to put the two together. I want to take this interview and put it into the studio footage. To do that, uh, once you're in your interview video, you simply have to go to export and we're going to export it as a file and choose the right format, which is MP4 video. And make sure that we've got the right uh, resolution. So we want to make sure we're under PAL, general, widescreen, and then probably 720p will be good enough because the uh, Kindles won't be filming any higher than this. And even if you've used an iPad and you've got higher quality video, I'd still say use 720p because it'll be quicker to export it. So press finish. It'll ask for a file name. So you probably want to save it into your shared area. I'm going to put it in a demo folder and I can call this interview export. Press save and it starts the exporting progress. And depending on how complex or how long your video or how many complex transition you have, it might take a bit longer to do it. So you need to give yourself uh, five or 10 minutes for this export to work. Okay, so my export is now finished and I can close that one down. Now that I've exported uh, this timeline, I'll just save my changes, I can now open my title and studio project again and I can import the video that I've just exported. And now that video is added to my, uh, my media for this project and I can drag and drop that into the appropriate place in my timeline. And now, after my uh, news presenters have announced this, this item, it will cut across to them. And there you go, that's how you do it. So it's a really simple process, you just need to export using the right settings. Once you've got your whole video finished and you've cut all of your interviews and your reports into your studio sections in the right places, all you need to do to finish the project and hand it in is export the master uh, timeline, again as a file, again MP4, again PAL, general, widescreen, 720. But just now, this is your finished project. So ship late news, demo team, finished video. Oops. Press save and let that run. And again, that's going to take a little bit longer again. So that's now probably going to take a good 10 minutes to export. And once that's done and it's in your uh, folder on the network, then that's it and it's ready for me to mark and we can watch each other's. So that's all you need to do to export your finished project.